Hello friends, welcome to Code Crush Coding. In this video, we are going to learn how to print the alphabets in Java. Like we will start from alphabet A till alphabet Z. So we want to print all the letters in the alphabet. So this is a very tricky question that interviewer asks you to print all the letters of the alphabet using a Java code. So it is a very simple code that you can implement. Just you need to be aware of the steps that you need to follow. So first thing all these characters can be stored in a data type char. So let's declare a char data type char let's say ch. So this is our character data type okay. Now we will have a for loop. So how we can declare a for loop. So we will say here for character the first character will always be a let's say we want to print the uppercase. So we will say here starting from uppercase a and remember whenever you assign the value to a character data type it should be always in a single quotes now next step will be our character should be less than or equal to z because the last character that we want in the alphabet is z so it should always be less than or equal to z and every time we will increase the character value so ch plus plus so in this way you have declared the for loop and now inside the for loop you just need to print the character ch okay now let's run this code let's see whether this works or not so what we have done we have declared a character we have assigned the initial value of character till a and we will increase the for loop till we get the value of character as z now let's run this code So see we are getting here characters starting from a b c continue till z so here we are able to print the alphabets starting from a till z so only we need to implement the logic of this for loop but how internally it is working so for every character there is one integer value assigned to it and that is called as ascii value so internally not these alphabets are getting incremented but the value of these characters are getting incremented like for this a there is one integer value let me print that also so you will have the clear idea so let's say you declare one integer value here let's say int i and what we will do we will assign this i here to every character so what this statement will do whatever character value you have so for the first time the character value is a so a is assigned to i okay but i is of type integer so i will store the integer value of this character a next time the character value will be b so i will store the integer value of character b let me print that also so let's say we print character then we have some space and then we also print it value which is also called as ascii value let's run this code so see now here we can see the first time character a is printed and its integer value is 65 next time 66 which is for the b so in similar way 67 68 69 for each alphabet it continues till z which has the integer value as 90 now we have printed the alphabets in uppercase now let's say we want to print them in the lowercase so here we will just say it will start from lowercase a and it will continue till lowercase z now notice the difference here the integer value will also change like for uppercase it was starting from 65 okay now let's see for how it works for the lowercase now let's run this code so see we are getting all the lowercase characters here starting from a till z and here you can see the lowercase starts from 97 and so on each time the value is incremented and also the alphabet is incremented by 1 so in this way you can answer the question for how to print the number all the characters of a alphabet using a for loop and also you have the knowledge of ascii values for the character so that's it in this video we will cover another coding question in next video thank you for watching